When I first looked at uh, Carly's heart, uh, I saw a major heart defect. When we walked into the hospital room after she had surgery, there's just tubes, wires, tapes everywhere. I mean, they're so tiny and just everything is covered. So it's, it's scary. We had three surgeries to go through and they were all difficult. If there was another girl having a surgery like me, I would tell her to be brave and it, it's okay. I was about 20 weeks pregnant, and we were in for a routine anatomy scan, and we were really excited to find out whether we were having a boy or a girl. And we found out we were having a girl, and about uh, 10 minutes later, we found out the right side of her heart never developed. The heart has usually two upper and two lower chambers, and vessels come out of it. And in Carly's case, the right lower chamber has not developed. At that time, we were terrified. They made it sound like this is something that will be, that can be fixed, but we were thinking, like, how can this possibly be fixed? This is a major heart defect. And when I talked about them about this defect, it's um, I had to mention them that this kind of heart defects will need surgery. That was probably the first point where we thought like, oh wow, they really do fix this. And by the time I went to deliver her, we knew exactly what was gonna happen. We knew she was gonna be born, we knew what doctors was, were gonna look at her, what they were gonna decide, and we would have um, the actual plan the day she was born. So when we walked into the hospital room after she had surgery, there's just tubes, wires, tapes everywhere. I mean, they're so tiny and just everything is covered. So it's, it, scary. Of course, I broke down when I saw her, but they, the nurses were there and they assured, no, no, this is all normal. We went from having a really bad day, walking into that hospital room and being like, oh my gosh, our, our baby, to like, wow, look, she's doing great. We had three surgeries to go through and they were all difficult. So even after you finished the first one or the second, you realized there was still another one to go. The third surgery, she was three years old and I was kind of terrified about that because she was a toddler and how do you explain what you're, what's going on to a three-year-old? But she handled it perfect. My scar is this big, I think. I think the day that I met Christy and I saw little Carly's heart, I think that was the day that we became family. And through the course of the years, I was able to observe her, how she grew, how happy she was as a baby. And through all these operations, three operations, they are open heart surgeries, they are major operations. As adults, probably, we would not be able to go through them as smoothly as she did. She never complained, she was always a happy child, and that just struck me about Carly. You know, growing up, uh, being brave was always a superhero or action, action hero, uh, but now I've seen that uh, bravery can just be a three-year-old girl up against uh, really tough odds. Because of the American Heart Association's research, Carly is going to have a bright future. She's going to be able to do things that she wouldn't have been able to do 30 or 40 years ago. Carly is a brave girl, and I cannot wait to see her conquer the world. I am brave because I am a fighter. <laughs>